On this edition of the HDTV Morning Announcements, AP, PE, TE. The news starts now. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, all. I'm Mo. And I'm Chicken Daddy. Okay. Well, on lines two, we're going to have spicy, or grilled, that. <laughs> uh, line three, we're going to have grilled cheese, and line four, we're going to have cheese crunchers, whatever those are, and line five, you know, closed. And a happy birthday goes out to Connor Boone, Tiara Collins, Draven Large, Christopher Nader, Soto, and Jay St Stacker. Now to sports with Nick. Thanks, Skyler. On senior night last night, the track team was able to win the Frankfurt Relays. The first place finishers were Myers, Zamora, Van Deventer, and Gooden in the shot put. Molinax, Earl, Garcia, and Myers in the discus. Jordan, Haynes, Ramey, and Bariga in the high jump. Salih, Alanis, Ventura, and Hernandez in the 4x1600. And Ryan out the crew, Espedio, Valdez, Trenado, and Wilkins in the 4x800. The Frankfurt Varsity softball team Shut out Delphi by a score of 12-0 yesterday. Avery Drew, Kylie Norman, Chloe Roberts, Sydney Whitaker, and Kimi Kima all had two hits on the day. Avery got the win on the mound, pitching five innings, allowing zero runs on two hits, and striking out three. The JV softball team also defeated Delphi by a score of 12-0. Michaela Harper got the win for the Dogs, pitching four, win four innings, allowing zero runs on one hit, and striking out a total of 12. The JV girls collected a total of seven hits on the day. Both teams will be traveling to Western Boone to take on the Stars at 5.30 tonight. Following along the lines of shutouts, the varsity baseball team defeated Southmont on Friday by a score of 10-0. Casey Henry and Jose Valdez Sandoval combined to throw a no-hitter. Jack Wilkins hit a home run in the win as well. Yesterday, the team ended up losing to Westfield by a score of 8-6. Jose Valdez Sandoval led the offense with three hits. The team will be traveling to Western Boone today, with the first pitch being thrown at 5.30. That's all the sports-related news for today. Back to you, Skyler. Practice for Summer's Marching Band will be held Wednesday from 4 to 5.15. Anyone is welcome to join the band. If you're looking for a summer job, this one's for you. NHK is interviewing for first-time, part-time positions. Check your school email for more details. Maymester is going going on. It will continue until the 17th from 3 to 6 each day. Transportation is not provided as you may well know. Now for a short segment on teacher appreciation. Yeah, I think students should go up to their teacher and personally thank them for what they do, but another idea is for the students to write personal letters or notes to their teachers to thank them for all the things that they do for them. Teacher Appreciation Week is the most important to me because it gives you a chance to appreciate your teachers for everything they've done and everything they're going to do for you. It's either they make sure you graduate or they just help you out with homework or anything. The smallest bit of, bit of chunk of hope and respectfulness can lead to a big heart. I think when you look, think about school, everybody thinks back to their teachers and how teachers inspired them to be where they are. And so just taking that moment to appreciate what the teachers do for our students on a daily basis and what those students can become is why it's so important to take that week and honor them and appreciate everything they've done throughout the year for our students, for the whole staff, because like he said, they're the foundation to the school. From the administration, we would like to thank all of the teachers for what they do every day. We have been, all been teachers ourselves. We know um, what an empowering and important career choice that is. And we know that they do so much for our students and our community. And we would just like to take a moment and appreciate them. So thank you so much. Cheers, Teach. Anyway. AP exams continue today and run through May 16th. All AP exams will take place right here at FHS in rooms 303 and 305. 
Students taking morning exams should report to their exam room at 7.30. Afternoon exams should report to test rooms at 11.30. All AP students should have signed up for a mine. Please see your AP teacher or Mrs. Hickson if you have any questions. And due to construction, the library will be closed after lunch. And finally, we have another video from the PE department featuring Mr. Potts. Um, Shape America is a, has um, a lot of resources and um, I don't have to tell a lot of uh, young people where to go to search out information. Uh, you know very well there's so many sources out there. Seek them out. Um, well, everyone can participate by um, reevaluating your, your schedule and seeing where you have time. Everybody has time to move. Don't try to do two hours of exercise. Start with five minutes. Thanks, Mr. Potts. I'll make sure to use all the Bings and Googles. Anyway, that's going to be it for the announcements today. Have a great Taco Tuesday and remember, join marching band. And from me to you, Speed is the best meme of 2019. Bye. <laughs>